Hey guys, welcome back to vlog number 15, I think, to the BrickLink store business. So I have currently two orders ready. I need to get these packed up. I'm going to get those printed out real quick. It is currently, oh, come on, 8.22 a.m. I had to wake up early so I can try and knock out these three orders before I left. I do have another two orders um, to complete afterwards. That one was a beast, uh, so that one's pretty awesome. Um, I think I should have padded up uh, the box a little bit better, but I think for the most part, I put you know this in there, so that should hopefully keep things from moving, and there's uh, some big Mario pieces that uh, I'm so happy to finally sell. Uh, now I just got to sell those tube things in there, but um, those were a bunch of support beams or whatever, so those are gone, so that's awesome, but that was uh, $89. Um, I'm not sure exactly how much I got from that. Uh, do I see it on here? No, I don't. I don't know why that's not refreshed. Oh, I haven't booted up my computer since last night. Okay. So yeah, I'm working on these three orders. I have like 100 lots left to pick, uh, or just under 100 lots for three orders here. And there's two more orders. I definitely don't think I'll have enough time to pick them all. And it is my dad and stepmom's anniversary. So I'm going to hang out with them for a little bit before I have to leave. But I really need to complete these three, so I will definitely do that right after I get done with those. And I'll have a look at the other ones, I'll refresh the page, see how bad they are, you know, how long they might take. But for the most part, I might have to tell them that I won't be able to help them until I get back from uh, my drill weekend. So that's all for right now. All right, guys, it is 928, and I'm still working on these three orders because it was like over 100 extra lots I needed to pick. And uh, what am I at right now? I'm at 138 at 191. So less than 60 lots left. So I'll definitely be able to get it done. Uh, however, I just got two more orders in. One from Brick Owl, which is just three lots. So I picked uh, one of the lots right now. I'm going to pick the other two real quick. And there's another order that just came in for BrickLink. Literally, while I was just picking those parts out. Um, let me double check. Is this, is it this one? Uh, 10 lots. So I could just pick that one real quick, you know, knock out these two quick and easy ones. Um, I'm not sure. Let's see what the value is. 28 on this BrickLink order. So that's definitely nice. It's fantastic. Uh, not as much on this Brick Owl, 1390. So that's pretty cool. Oh, we got 30 minutes until my premiere. So that's cool. Uh, so I'm going to get these done real quick since it's not too bad uh there's not too many items in them so i'll knock them out and i'll see you in a second all right guys it is uh just about to be 12 p.m and i got the 10 orders done there's three left i can't knock them out right now there's 87 lots for them i gotta eat gonna pack up the car um there's a bunch of returns also that my dad wants me to take with me to uh places i'm gonna be going to in west virginia because i ordered a bunch of the menard tough store stuff and i'm gonna go into the store as well so i have to go to west virginia before i go to pittsburgh that sucks uh it's gonna be a long day for me but um hopefully i'll get there semi fast uh fingers crossed i can get to pittsburgh by five or six that'd be great i do need gas for my car i gotta figure out which car i'm actually taking because um my stepmom wants me to take their car because there's snow potentially coming this weekend or something like that so I will go find out all my details for my trip real quick. Well, I don't think I was telling you also what I was doing uh, on my trip up to Pittsburgh. I'm in West Virginia right now. You can see kind of, uh, the camera quality isn't the best, but in person it looks pretty awesome. Uh, yeah, so I'm in West Virginia. I'm at Menards. Uh, first time coming here. I need to pick up an order, and I want to just check real quick uh, if they have anything else for stack on so i don't have to place an order online or if they also have any of the ones that they're discontinuing that would be phenomenal but yeah uh i'm an hour and 14 minutes away i think from uh pittsburgh so hopefully this doesn't take too long uh in and out would be great all right guys it is monday morning december 6 8 20 a.m and i'm back from my drill weekend and i've been tracking this whole the whole weekend we're up to almost 40 orders i think now it's crazy. I've received so many, so many throughout this weekend. 
I was very surprised. I think t yesterday was like at least 10 orders I received. That's awesome. So we're doing really well and I'm going to be like stuck in a two day handling for most of these. Uh, the majority I'll be getting done today. I think at least 28 I can get done. So I'm shooting for that. Uh, and then the rest will be shipped out tomorrow because there are about 600 lots I need to pick. So it's definitely going to take me some time. But for the most part, I'm going to be knocking out the small ones and the later ones, the, the ones that came first uh, today so I can get those out. And then uh, everyone else that paid like after Saturday evening, pretty much, um, they'll be going out tomorrow. I'm going to inform all the customers as quickly as I can uh, once I get these other orders all picked and such so I can have a good understanding of like what's left. So we have 18, 42, 3, 44, 1, 2, and 20 lots for these seven orders on Brick Owl. 130 lots, 1,028 items. Good value for all those. Then we jump to Mr. Brick Link with 19 orders, one pending. That is my friend Jeff. Hopefully he uh, is able to pay here soon. Uh, I just received another order on um, eBay. So we'll hopefully refresh the page real quick. But you can see at the bottom here, 453. So the other one combined with this one equals almost 600. And I'm going to count eBay as getting me over 600 because that's like 11 orders now. Uh, so 2,872 items. I definitely need to add some more uh, sets here soon. Uh, so take this as 12 now. I'm not going to refresh it because my computer is very old. So it's going to take forever. But um, if those two pay, then it'll bump it up even further, or unless that is like that. So um, right now, there are 11 orders that I need to ship out on eBay, and I'm going to track that. I'm going to tell you guys how long it takes me to pick those, because eBay is usually very fast. It's a lot faster than Bricklink and Owl, unless Bricklink and Owl are two lots each, and like minifigures. I sold a ton of minifigures this weekend. I was so surprised. This is a mistake down here package. Um, I am sending out Kingo's torso from uh, the internals. I had to purchase another internal set because someone purchased uh, Kingo. So I was able to get this for 42 bucks, I think. So $42 I had to spend for this. And, you know, there's some extra value in here. I'm trying to get the uh, other legs back for Kingo uh, because I sent out two legs to one person. So that was a horrible mistake. That's costing me probably about eight bucks since he's probably going to have to go to the post office and get a shipping label since I cannot create a QR code label for him to scan at the post office. It just is not a possibility for me as a small seller. So let's get ready to rumble. All right, so eBay's all done. This took me about 10 minutes uh, to pull all 11 of them. I found out I actually have two more of the Dominus Rexes, so I can get an extra like 35 bucks each for those. I think I took them off of my stores. I'm going to double check, of course, on Bricklink to see if I actually sold them on there, but I think I have extra ones. But uh, Poe, Crosshair, Green Goblin, Mantis, Miles Morales, Spider-Man, Peter Parker, Spider-Man, not sure which version. Um, Thomas Rex, of course, uh, Lady from Harry Potter, uh, Diagon Alley set, um, Ron, Golden Ron, 20th uh, edition, uh, Captain America, and then the two big boys, 35 bucks each, I'm pretty sure, or actually $30 and 35. This is the, uh, Dumbledore, and this is Haggard, so... That is it. Let me pack these up and move on to um, small Brick Lincoln uh, Brick Owl orders. All right, so this will be the first to ever have this many print at one time. 11 coming out. That is awesome to feel. I've weighed it all, so it's, you know, it's got the right ounces and such. Had to weigh this guy real quick because he's five ounces. So, boom. Now let's get them ready to go. All right, so I have the first eight Brick Link and Brick Owl orders done. So you can see, uh, we'll go through real quick. So this is two orders. I don't know why he did that, but it's one order for sure. Like I refunded him the shipping for the uh, extra one. Then we have two figures in there, two figures in here uh, from Diagon Alley. Um, 
Spider-Man Big Time, I think it was. Bo-Katan and one part there. Bo-Katan. Actually, I should double-check that. I didn't think that they were right next to each other. And then um, uh, Venom, a bunch of parts. Uh, Pink Yoshi and the shark from video sets. So, yeah, first aid orders done pretty fast. All right, another six done. Uh, I need to just double check to make sure everything is correct because it is a little difficult having it set up like this. You know, small orders um, can fit in trays like this, but since, uh, you know, I had to configure that this is like two lots, which I don't think that is right. Uh, let me check A real quick. Let me put you off the screen. Three lots for A. So, oh, okay. Um, so it is that as well. I pulled that off a second ago. Okay, so that's three. Uh, so yeah, I'm just going to double check. I saw something interesting with Darth Vader uh, down here. There's um, there's like a set, uh, almost a set of three in here, but it's missing the torso and the legs, but it has the helmet and it has the head, and it's missing that as well. So I'm really confused why that is set up that way. I'm hoping that I did not mess up big time for an order. I'm hoping that I just got extra, but I do have a few others um, laying around. Here's another three. Uh, I think I have another one here, maybe another set of them. So fingers crossed that that's okay, but you know, I'm just going to double check to make sure everything is all good. So this is going to be another six. That's what the pile looks like right now. And here's what it looks like now. And there is the pile, 25 orders done, and I need to complete three more that need to go out today. So I'm going to do that here now. I'm going to get things ready, 87 lots I need to pick, so not too bad. The rest I will be picking later. Um, I can't throw everything in today to try and complete it all because I just don't have any time. I have a few things I got to handle, so later tonight... I will hopefully try my best to complete everything, um, you know, before streaming and then uh, during and after streaming, I will hopefully finish everything. But I will have about 10 orders to complete and a little over 400 lots. So that will definitely take me about five hours to do. So that sucks. <laughs> but I want to knock everything else out so I can get it out the door uh, because it will be 28 orders going out today. That will be awesome. I wish I could do everything, but I need sleep. <laughs> uh, I would have uh, done it all last night if I didn't need sleep. So let's continue. All right. So I got these three orders done now and I'm going to pack them up and head off to the post office. It doesn't open for another couple minutes. Um, they're closed for lunch times usually. So I'm going to get ready for that. Uh, get these printed out and um, pack up the 28 orders. All right, guys, it is nighttime it is uh let's see can it show up 9 24 p.m and i you know i did good earlier got down to like nine orders left now it's up to 12 so 545 lots i think it is uh really sucks <laughs> there's a lot to go through i'm going to do as much as i can tonight i'm not going to be picking orders i'm just going to be sorting um so I've already completed two sets down there. Those guys have been sitting there for a while, so finally got uh, took care of them. I have uh, two sets on my bed already that I'm hopefully going to sort. There are two more right here, and oh, three more. That one down there as well, I could grab that. That one over there, so that's four. And then there's these two that I might not need to do since they're pretty easy to find parts since they're pretty much creator type of sets that are already separated like you know these guys um so that should be all right so i'm definitely going to try as much as i can uh that's already like six sets or something so yeah let's get busy all right guys it is tuesday morning 9 25 a.m december 7th and i have 15 orders 591 lots 3626 so my goal for today is to at least knock out 300 lots um so starting from the bottom uh, the oldest ones uh, i've already sent out messages yesterday to everyone um most people responded uh one person scared me <laughs> it's like 
I understand there's a delay. Uh, we live in the same state, so if there is any more issues, then uh, just let me know. And there was like so much more. It was like two paragraphs of um, whatever. So it's like, okay. So I'm going to look at what order that is and try and knock it out today. Um, I'm hoping that it's one of the ones that are in a uh, like came Saturday or something like that, which I am trying my best to get everything done. I shipped out 28 orders yesterday, so I'm pretty happy about that, but I still have 15 left um, and one eBay order, so I can pick that right now because it's super fast. It's um, I don't know if I remember where the location is, but for the most part, I know that it is... Um, this general so I can grab him now and get that shipped out so that's fantastic all right I have five orders done pretty awesome uh, some my quick ones I have three more that I need to get out today I do have time so I, I just need to pack these other ones uh, that I just showed you and then I can get to these three which are pretty big I think there's 270 lot ones so I'm just working through the list uh, I think that's gonna Bring me pretty close to like seven left or something if I'm able to get those done today. So I should be caught up by the end of the day if I am quick enough to get these three done. It just depends on these three. So let's finish her up. All right, guys, it is now 7.08 p.m. And I am uh, getting ready to start on the last seven orders, 333 lots left. I just finished sorting this last one with my little siblings. They helped me real quick uh, knock out these two, so that's awesome. I think that's everything that I needed to sort uh, so I can finish up strong for the um, wave of uh, stuff that came in during the weekend, uh, which most of that is already done. I think it's just uh, Sunday night and Monday um, orders, so those will be done today, hopefully, uh, 333 lots. It's going to be crazy, but uh, going to try and knock it out. Going to do the three small ones now, 20-some lots each, and then I'll knock out uh, two different waves of 70 lot and I think 50 lot. Um, and I definitely need to vacuum up my room. It is a mess in here and clean things up. So as soon as I'm done with all this, then I can get caught up with other stuff, put things in place, finally get things numbered um, and start working on putting things in the drawers again. Still got to finish things over here. Um, sand green's been there for like a week now. Black has been started. Um, my little siblings put things in the cups. They didn't finish everything. I don't know why, but uh, I'll get that done here soon. Try and knock it out. Still got a bunch of random stuff up here, so hopefully I can uh, get that into a location as well. Need to definitely number these guys here soon so I don't lose track of things. I did sell another Mantis. Um... She's somewhere in here. Uh, I need that for an order. There she is. New sh I knew it didn't sell her yet. Uh, just sold her on eBay for 18 bucks. So that's pretty awesome. So I'm going to get her ready uh, and uh, move on. All right. Just got done with these three orders. They're all done. I'm going to pack them up. You can see what they got. Pretty much a lot from the Spider-Man set here. And then uh, this order's got a bunch of stuff as well. And the larger lot one does not have bigger parts than the other ones so kind of a waste over there but gonna get ready for the 70 lot ones definitely gonna use up these two big ones um just gotta pack these up and uh get ready for hopefully finishing off the rest 252 lots remain so let's do it all right so i think this is the time to take advantage and add the damas rexes back I don't know why the count was off, but I still have two left, and those are worth like 40 bucks each. Um, and I'm coming down here for this guy. Uh, I got $37 full asking price that I had set up for him. Someone uh, like an hour ago um, tried asking it for 30 bucks, and I counted it with 33 So I'm glad uh, he didn't respond because I got it for 37 That's awesome. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get that shipped out and another eBay order. And now I'm going to finally pack those. I'm probably going to work on Jeff's order so I can get this out of here. Bulio or whatever he keeps calling it. <laughs> so that would be awesome to finally get rid of. Well, I was about ready to start uh, packing those guys up. But I got an awesome order because I was literally talking about this yesterday to Jeff. Uh, because I wanted all these Pekin Yoshis to get out of here. And he was going to buy one for $450. But uh, 
Um, I don't think we ever finished talking about it. I was going to lower the price. Luckily, I never did because I sold three at the price I had previously. So that is awesome. So that is going to go out uh, tomorrow. And that's an easy order picked right away. $22 and 34 seconds. Uh, fantastic. All right, now let's pack this up so I can uh, get started on the other ones before I have to go to bed. Man, it's going to be late tonight because I... Uh, what do I have left? Whatever I said before in the last few clips, 200 something lots. So let's get busy. All right, so I got about 70 so lots done. 42 on here, 72 total. Um, Yeah, I probably have about 170 something left to do, but I've just got this so far. So I have two different ones set up. Uh, this one is with Jeff. Um, his is probably 14 lots in or something out of the 57. So working on it all, but I'm going to call it quits for tonight uh, because I'm afraid of being too loud, uh, pulling orders and such. So I've knocked out the majority and I will finish up everything in the morning and hopefully I can wake up early enough to knock it out uh, and get on with the day with other things I got to do. So it's awesome to finally be mostly caught up um, as soon as this is done. Then I can uh, move on and do some other things. Had to go through the stickers. I bought some things from Amazon to hopefully store things a little bit better. So I have that coming. Um, and I'm going to throw all those. I think before I go to bed, I will get these printed out. These four orders so that I don't have to worry about them in the morning. I can just worry about the other four and move on with that. And hopefully... We, uh, you know, it'd be great if we get another order tonight, but hopefully not uh, as big as the ones I have to pick right now because these are the back end, uh, the very big ones, big boys I got to pick. So uh, let's get ready for tomorrow. All right, guys, it is Wednesday morning, 10, 28. I started a little bit later than I wanted to, but I have about 90, just under 90 uh, lots left to pick for the second orders these ones are done. I'm going to pack them up real quick and get started on these. Um, then I have a few projects to handle around the house with my dad. And then hopefully later today, uh, since I'm all done with the orders, I can knock out some more stuff uh, working on the drawers, um, making sure I fill in everything that I have. I also did notice when I was picking yesterday that I was going to have an issue whenever I got down to this one because um, it starts with a B100 and such. And, you know, I have a B100 over here instead of the B0 in front of it. So I am trying to figure out an issue or a way around that. More than likely, I should just put a B0100, so on until 120. And then I will have these other ones as well. So I will have to do B0100 and like 12 or however much it goes for. So... Um, that's going to be my way around that little issue, uh, cause I didn't initially think about it, uh, and I wasn't going to have this system to begin with of Alpha, Bravo, Charlie, Delta, and then, you know, so on and so forth with, um, what am I going to be up to H? I'm going to be a little bit further because of all the, uh, other ones I have over there, but it's going to be nice having that little system set up over here. Hopefully going to try and do that here soon. I will just try my best to put whatever I can in there now, and I might build this uh, before I start filling it up, but I might start numbering it all before it as well, because that will definitely save some time. Um, so going to think uh, figure things out, but let's pack these up. All right, all done with these other ones. Did not take too long, pretty fast. Got to pack it up now and get the label ship uh, printed out for the four of them. And move on to the other things. All right, guys, it is new now. I'm about to head off to the post office to bring the final orders from this weekend. Uh, kind of this weekend was like Monday and Tuesday. These orders I'm about to ship out um, that came in. And the total, I think, was about 46 or something orders that I packed and got shipped out. It was amazing. We did a lot of work and within like 20 hour period, and we pulled in, I think, $1,200 and 979 is going to my bank. 
So that's awesome. Uh, it's already, you know, transferred and such, but I had to spend at least 650 already to get more stuff in for resale. So hopefully that'll come in soon so I can uh, get that money back. That'll be great. And, uh, you know, keep cycling that money for uh, new stuff, new product and such. Uh, that's going to be the goal cycling everything that I get back. So I'm pretty happy with the weekend. I was about 70% ready for it though, because I was away at my military training um, for the weekend. So that kind of put me behind a little bit. There was only three orders that suffered for, from it. It was at about a day and a half since they ordered is the delay of shipping it out. So I already apologized and um, was thanking them for the patience because those three buyers already responded about it. So pretty happy that it was uh, pretty successful and um, everyone was pretty happy with uh, the results of it. Uh, or actually, you know, they haven't gotten delivered yet, but um, I'm happy that everyone that I had to make communication with were okay with uh, the delay on uh, their orders and such. But yeah, it was about $48 an hour that I made with the 979. So I'm pretty happy about that. Definitely need to continue doing that, continue growing. Um, $50, I guess, would be the goal. I need to make it more efficient enough to reach that point. Definitely would have uh, done everything a lot faster if I had everything in the drawers. So that is my objective, get everything in the drawers. So see you guys in the next clip. All right, so it is Wednesday night, 10, 11. I have to do an assignment real quick, but I do have four orders. Uh, we have two on eBay. And uh, one is the Green Goblin, but for some reason it's not showing up on this screen here. And then the other one is Marvel Captain America. We'll go on over to Brick Freedom real quick and see that these two orders are pretty easy as well. Four and seven lots and really nice value. So pretty happy that I don't have to do any major work, especially since I have to go to Gettysburg in the morning. So um, I'll be stopping off at the post office pretty much uh, on my way, if not over into Gettysburg or something, I'm going to figure it out. I'm not sure what time I'm going to be leaving, but I got to do my assignment real quick and I'll pick these orders and I'll show you what they look like in a minute. All right. My bad with the eBay order. It wasn't the green goblin, but I did sell one. Um, so I sold a Darth Vader though. Uh, I sold this a couple days ago. The guy finally paid. So that's awesome. I got the payment for that. Here is where the Green Goblin is, if it's not too dark, and a Venom, two other parts in there, and this is a bulk item order, so I'm pretty happy to be getting rid of a lot of these panels. Now I just have the panel with the printing on it uh, left for the Harry Potter and Hermione uh, buildable figure things, so I'm gonna get those packed up and uh, move on. All right, guys, it is a little past noon right now. I uh, ran a bunch of my errands a little bit ago, and I am in Gettysburg right now, like in the battlefield area. You can see cannons off to my right there. I'm heading to Big Round Top right now. Um, it's like a mile hike up to it, so I'm probably not gonna do that. I'm just gonna go to Little Round Top. It's got a decent scenic view. It's a little bit better than Big Round Top, but um, yeah, I'm gonna do that real quick before I head back to a 50 cent place that uh, I went to probably an hour ago. See if I can pick up anything else for uh, 50 cents. It was a pretty nice deal. And especially asking about a bulk uh, buy for cassette tapes was a good idea because I got a bunch of them for five bucks. I think it's probably gotta be over 80. I'll organize it later. It looked like they were just thrown into the box, but there's hopefully quite a few um, in there and hopefully a lot of good ones. That would be nice. but. Uh, I also went to Walmart and picked up 10 of the 1500 part creator sets. Uh, unfortunately, they weren't $29. I'm probably never gonna find, never gonna find that deal here uh, in my area. So I just picked up 10 just to have them and I could return them you know, at my Walmart so that they have that stock back and such and maybe they'll be like, oh, we're gonna drop it. That's, that's probably actually a good idea so I can uh, come back whenever it's uh, $10 after Christmas. Uh, I might plan on doing that, you know, play the system a little bit so I can save money. But um, yeah, I'm gonna do this little Gettysburg real quick. Uh, you'll see that in the next few clips, I'll show you what all I have in the trunk. Here is the view from right next to the parking lot, pretty much, or semi parking lot just over there. But 
Uh, looks like there's some event going on over here filming. I usually go to that castle, but it looks like it's closed down for right now. But it is not too cold here. I might go to the High Rock place as well, uh, near my uh, house, because that one's pretty cool. Good view of everything, and a lot higher than this, too. So yeah, that's, uh, that's this view. I'm gonna head out here in a second. Just like seeing uh, this area sometimes. I wish there was a higher point so you could see everything, the whole battlefield, because most of it happened over there. And uh, this is just like the lookover point or something of troop movements over in the distance. So yeah, this is pretty awesome. All right, guys, it is 5.20 p.m. and I finally got the 50 pounds of Lego. Need to go through that real quick. Uh, put things in my stock room and take the, um, the minifigure numbers and add them to eBay ASAP. I need need to start making money on those guys right away. Hopefully I get the other ones here soon. I don't know if he shipped it out yet, but got a bunch of cassette tapes today, a bunch of other things as well. A uh, bunch of um, magic cards over there as well. Hopefully go through that eventually. Uh, this as well, you know, priority is probably VHS. It took about an hour sorting all this. Um, so I'll be on my shelf here soon. I'm gonna put the label on them here soon. A, B, C, D, so on and so forth for this shelf. Hopefully we'll be able to get rid of a lot of this here soon. That would be great. But um, it's just going to take a little bit to list it all. So I'm going to try my best to move it fast. We got a bunch of things over here that I'm not sure totally about because I got them pretty much for 10 cents a piece at one of these um, uh, stores, uh, thrift stores. So uh, most of this will be uh, looked at later on after all that is done. And maybe these guys, because that might be worth it because I only spent five bucks for it. Also had the baseball cards, uh, football, hockey, basketball down in the basement. So we got a lot to take care of, but the primary thing is uh, Bricklink to start with. eBay definitely is worth a lot more and easier than uh, Bricklink, but you know, I got to work, work around everything. And you know, I still have all this other stuff over here that I have not dealt with at all yet. Um, I, I got to find some time. <laughs> I need uh, more time in a day to uh, knock things out, but that's all for right now. All right, guys, it is currently 10.31 p.m. on Thursday night. I have four orders here, 15, 80, 36, and 72. I'll be picking that tomorrow morning. Uh, I did pick the eBay orders. I had two. We sold another Luigi uh, since I got those back, so I'm glad I sold one. Got to sell the other one that I got back, and I do think I have three more in there as well, so I got to pull those out. Um, and I've pretty much already added the other things, the other items and minifigures to my store, my eBay store. So that is fantastic. I do plan on selling some of the sets, like especially the set that, um, is a pain to deal with. One of the Harry Potter sets, I think it's 76388. I remember that name by heart now because I've had like 30 of them by now, but seven minifigures, bunch of Harry Potter guys, uh, heading out for this order. I think this was a $44 order, I think, and that was a $30 order, so pretty good value out of the eBay. All right, so last night we sold a few more things. We sold uh, another Darth Vader, so I got to take that off of Bricklink and take this one off of Bricklink as well. $14 and $12 for Thanos, so glad to finally sell another Thanos. I think this is the second one. I still have like eight left. <laughs> it's it's crazy that Thanos hasn't been selling too much. I definitely had to lower the price in order to sell this one. So $12, that's very unfortunate. I think I have him set at 14 though. So I accepted the best offer because I want him gone. So yeah, just made two more sales. Had to accept the best offer because this guy's been sitting here for a while. But this one uh, definitely was quite a bit extra. So that was nice. And I still have, I think, two more of that one and three more of that one. So got plenty left. Got to get a business card ready for it, but I got to babysit today, so unfortunately I cannot do orders, uh, break link orders and such, so I'm apologizing for the delay because of that, so that sucks, but i um, happy to have pretty much five orders going out today, so that's awesome. All right, guys, so I just completed uh, the five orders, so you can see we got a uh, few orders that I started in the beginning. Um, they're all prepared. I just need to pack them up and such. Very small one that I was able to knock out pretty fast. I just added those minifigures and they sold right away. And that's 20 bucks right there into my $120 investment, I think. So 
uh, 100 bucks left I need to make back, which there are 10 more minifigures worth 10 bucks each. Some of them are worth a little bit more on eBay, so uh, I've already got like three watchers for some of them, so that would be fantastic if I sell them right away. Actually, I think six orders. I think I just said five, but six orders. So you can see we have a 72 lot one here, 80 lot one here, a lot of dark blue in there, a lot of tiles in this one, really easy order to pick, pretty happy to have it. So I'm going to pack all these up and get them ready to ship out and send the money to my PayPal and figure out how much uh, I made in the, uh, I think three hours it took for all this because it was a little bit hectic for some of it. All right, it is Saturday morning. I just picked last night's order right here. You can see a lot of small parts and one uh, Mandalorian loyalist. Uh, so got that. Got to get this in cardboard and get it shipped out. Going to be shipping out, I think, seven today. What do we got? I think this looks a little bit more than seven. Three, seven, okay, eight. Eight going out. I don't know. Oh, yeah, I had a minifigure that came afterwards. So, yeah, eight going out. Fantastic. All right, guys, I just got out of the post office. Going to head back home. My stepmom has a uh, graduation for her master's degree at 1130. So, luckily, I have enough time to get back. So, that's awesome. But, uh, yeah, I just got done with the post office. I went to Goodwill. Nothing there, unfortunately. So, I'll come back maybe tomorrow or Monday and uh, see if they got anything new and good. Um, and also they changed their tags. Like hopefully it's yellow tags because there is a lot of good yellow stuff that I want to get VHS wise and some movies, I guess. Um, but then uh, let's see. So yesterday, I'm sorry I couldn't get the vlog out for you guys. I was busy watching the kids for like six plus hours. My dad and stepmom had their anniversary last Friday and I was going to my drill weekend. So I could not watch the kids for them. Uh, and I think Thursday they had something going on last week. So I couldn't watch the kids either for them to have a date. So I um, had to watch them yesterday. So that delayed the orders going out, but it's all good. Um, I'm wanting to help them out because obviously they haven't had a date in a while and I, I'm super busy all the time and they're, they have their own stuff. They have a lot of stuff going on. So, but now things are going to be a little less chaotic since my stepmom's done with her school. I'm going to be done with my school next week. Um, I could even be done on Monday if I would, uh, you know, push myself to get everything done, which I still have to do the homework for this week. But, um, I'm going to end off the vlog here. Thank you all so much for watching because enjoyed and we shall see you, uh, next Friday, hopefully. Thanks for watching.